Joining me now is Pennsylvania Democratic Congressman Brendan Boyle, Budget Committee Ranking Member, who was with the President in Philadelphia yesterday at the unveiling of a budget which is really pretty much a campaign manifesto. Yeah, great to be with you, and it was especially great to be with the president yesterday in my district where he officially unveiled his budget proposal uh, for this year. Uh, those are the priorities that we're going to be fighting for, and I love the contrast, frankly, of everything the president talked about yesterday versus what the House Freedom Caucus just released today, which is extreme on steroids. That's the document that's dead on arrival. Well, when you're talking about the Freedom Caucus, you're talking about uh, big spending cuts, not on defense, increases on defense, but big spending cuts on domestic spending. Uh, massive spending cuts. I mean, their list of 10 demands reads more like a ransom note than a serious budget proposal. Uh, you know, Moody's Analytics came out with a very important report recently that analyzed what's been out there. Uh, of course, as you pointed out, the Republicans still don't have their own official budget, but based on what they've already put out there, Moody's analyzed it and said it would cause the economy to go into recession. It would cause uh, job losses, uh, numbering 2.6 million, and you would see an unemployment rate that right now is at a 50-year low, spike above 6 percent. We House Democrats, and certainly our Democratic colleagues in the Senate, are just not going to let that to happen.